Hey Aries, we're going to see what's going on with you currently and keep in mind the energies can always be vice versa. So some of you, there could be something to do with travel. All right, Scorpio. I'm sorry, Aries. Some of you could be dealing with a Scorpio. Aries. So, all right, your reading is already conflicting. So you could have someone who either you're trying to make peace with or they are. Um, there could be a lot of sadness and loss about something. But it's like a wish come true. Does that make sense? So maybe someone was your wish come true. Um, some of you could be going on to Las Vegas, live in Las Vegas. Um, gambling, some of you may like to play poker. You could be very isolated, spend a lot of time alone, but maybe you could feel like partnerships are just nothing but a burden. You know, it's just too much to even deal with. A lot of you, if you are going on a holiday or of some sort, um, make sure you keep your valuables locked up, especially if you're staying somewhere. Um, all right, Aries, what are your what are your obstacles? So you could have a visitor, someone coming to see you. Um, what are your obstacles, Aries? What are Aries obstacles? So now some of you, you may have a hard time socializing. You could be busy and occupied doing other things that, you know, you may feel the star. So some of you could be, hold up, some of you, all right, listen, there could be some type of financial loss as well. Okay. Be careful having people over to your house. You know, we think we can trust people, but make sure you keep things locked up. I keep seeing something needs to be locked up, whatever that is. Um, a lot of you could be in the spotlight. Um, so it's generosity. Hmm. All right, what is your outcome, Aries? You have a lot of success, though. A lot of success. So, okay. You having fun, socializing, being who you are is an obstacle. Just having fun, it could cause some type of financial loss. You, It may exclude you from something. Does that make sense? Um, I, I don't know what that means. All right. What is your outcome, Aries? What is your outcome? So, the King of Swords. I just feel like you're, you know, you may feel like something's being stolen from you, taken from you. Um, there's like an interference in something. It could be in finances. Um, hmm. um, anyway, your outcome is the King of Swords. You're just who you are. You're honest with who you are. So, teamwork, negotiating something, trying to balance something out. So, it could be a group effort. It could be, you know, can be anything. Roll the dice. See what happens. There could be... A... So, for some of you, you could have a mother visiting. Or, for some of you now, you are mothers and you just have a lot of responsibilities, you know. But there's some type of success in something. There could you could be feeling betrayed by either work, a person. Um, hmm. Okay, Aries. Interesting. Let me slide these over. Okay, Aries. Aries. So I feel like the situation involves holding your ground, standing your ground. I feel like a lot of this has to do with work. Okay, Aries. Aries. So you, you look very successful, independent. Um, you don't need anybody. Wow, the Empress. Some of you could be single mothers. Doesn't have to be. You know your worth. You, oops. See, there could be some type of interference, communication. Um, I feel like 
you're going to get a text, a phone call. You're going to get some type of communication from someone. You may be sleeping on someone. You may be trying to avoid someone or vice versa. I know this is going to sound ridiculous, but listen, someone may feel like, <laughs> I'm just going to say it, but I'm not saying that you're doing this. You know how this works. Someone may be saying that you're selling, I don't know, your body for money or sex for money or you do things for money. You know what I mean? And it's just stupid, but that is what I'm saying. I'm just saying. Um, ridiculous. They're probably just jealous and haters, you know. Anyway, because you look successful. You look good. Male or female. Um, your life is probably going good. You know what I mean? Okay, Aries, what are your obstacles? What are your obstacles? You have a lot of eyes on you as well. I just feel like love, possibly. Is love an obstacle for you? What are your obstacles? Some of you, someone could be pregnant. doesn't have to be. You know what I just got? I think you would rather have money over love. I think you look at love like, fuck that, and just give me the money. Show me the money. A lot of you, some of you could be very successful with what you do. Look, your home could be just absolutely beautiful. King of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Some of you could be married. I don't know. Could be dealing with an Aquarius as well, an Earth sign. But I feel like you, you've made it to the top, to the tippy top. So, it's like trying to stay where you are. Stay at your level of success, whatever this is. Some of you, there could be some type of travel. Um, there could be a lot of interferences with something that you have going on. All right, Aries, what is your outcome? Mm. All right, Aries, listen. I think a lot of people look up to you. Look, your outcome is happiness. Like, people need to recognize, and I hate to talk like this. I don't know why I want to cuss so much. People re need to recognize who the fuck you are is what I feel like you're saying. Y'all need to recognize me, respect me. Like, I don't know who you're playing with. <laughs> because I feel like you'll bite back. You're tired of being nice, too. I feel like you're going to bite back or you are biting back. Hmm. So someone may want to come in and barter something with you. They could speak a different language as well. Um, you could have some type of reunion, a get-together of some sort. All right. I keep wanting to call you Scorpio. Now Pisces. Um, Aries. All right, Aries. There could be a trip. Someone taking a trip. You taking a trip. Um, God, I keep wanting to say Pisces. Aries, Aries, Aries. Oh, goodness. So maybe there's a separation of some sort. You could have felt betrayed, been betrayed, stabbed in the back, you know, a lot of deception. You could have people attacking you, possibly. It could just be with words. I don't know. Um, maybe you're trying to separate yourself from these people or person, whoever this is kind of unsure about the future, what is to come. All right, Aries, what are your obstacles? What are Aries' obstacles? So you could be possibly feeling not enough or someone else now, if it's not you. Just kind of frustrated with everything, relationships, everything. I feel like you have a lot of jealous haters around you. A lot of you could be dealing with people who just want one night stands, stringing you along. Hmm. You could be healing from something, some type of toxic relationship, an addiction. I I just see, wow, the Grim Reaper coffin, R.I.P. I feel like you're done with the cassette tapes, with the replays, the repeats. Um, what is your outcome, Aries? What is your outcome? What is Aries' outcome? I'm hearing Libra for some reason. So, marrying someone, wow. You have the coffin and the grim reaper like 
finito. Something is done. Not today. Satan, you're not dealing with somebody. You could still be angry about something. You or someone else. Um, you got the death card again. And geez, okay. Someone could have passed. I don't know. Or something is just so done, like there's no coming back. Um, I keep wanting to call you Scorpio. And look at the butterfly. Transformation. Aries. Aries. So someone could be kind of upset and sad, depressed about something. Someone may, you know, need help. Be, you may be of service to someone. There could be like a sickness, an illness of some sort. It could be dodging someone or something altogether. Now, for some of you, if you're dealing with someone, this person, you got love or falseness, be careful with that. They could be at a distance, doesn't have to be. Um, maybe you've been of service to someone. You give and give and give. What, you know, maybe you don't feel like you get what you give. You don't get the same equal whatever in return. All right, Aries, what is your obstacles? You know what I'm also feeling like? Something around work. Something could feel, mm -hmm. it's like trying to climb the ladder of success, like keeping, staying wherever you are. I feel like you're at the top of something and you want to stay there or you're trying to climb there, whatever. But I feel like there needs to be some, maybe some more explore, um, explore other options, exploring other things. You get me? But I feel like you're fixing to take off and what I don't know. So say your obstacles are, there could be something that's just misfortune. Like, some of you, someone could live like where it's like a desert, a dry place, dry area, if that makes sense. Um, could be some type of sickness. A lot of money, though. Hmm. A young male, a young man. I don't know. Okay, why is this misfortune here for Aries? So gifts, money, receiving things. Maybe something has interfered with something. Hmm. So I'm telling you, someone could live at a, a distance from you. All right, what is your, what is Aries' outcome? What is your outcome? I'll let you read that. You have foe. So you have foe as an outcome. Hmm. So there could be an older person in your life who's kind of down, depressed. You may get a letter from this person. I don't know. Look, there's something about money. Wiring money, ATM, uh, Western Union, something about money, wiring money doesn't have to be, but a transfer of some type of money. Someone could say that they're sick, they have some type of illness. Just be careful you're not getting scammed. What is this foe? Not scammed by someone. See a foe, I have young woman, Lord, and hope, and doctor. So I, I don't know. Just, you know your story. If you feel like you're getting scammed, you, you know, you probably are. I don't know. Um, just depends on what this is talking about. Okay, Aries. We could be juggling a lot of things right now. All right, Aries. I, I just feel like something has come to an end. Death. So there could, someone could be moving, moving out of a home, changing locations. Something could just be kind of, you might just be tired of something. But now you could be dealing with a Leo, but you have strength and the page of wands. So there's a lot of change going on. You're not giving up on something. You, I'm telling you, there's like an opportunity knocking at your door getting clarity on something, truth, communication. 
Communication may cause a lot of stress and worry. Um, um, Aries, what are your obstacles? What are your obstacles? So, your obstacles could be, you could be dealing with the Taurus, don't have to be. Having, you know what I just heard? Having to, this is crazy. Having to be good, is that an obstacle? I feel like you're a hidden gem. Like there's something, look, I'm looking at, so there could have been some type of betrayal. Someone possibly knew they betrayed you. They did it purposely. Um, and so I feel like you turned your back on something just completely. You're looking that way. You're not looking back, period. Um, wow, you're moving forward. Happiness. I see a lot of luxury, money. Um, Aries. What what are your what is your outcome? So you may be feeling stuck in a situation or someone wants to keep you stuck or just kind of feeling frustrated about something. So what is your outcome, Aries? The Ten of Pentacles, I'm telling you. There's something, listen, that's why I said earlier, you better recognize, people need to recognize who you are or who you're about to be. You have a lot of success coming your way. Look, you're, you're leaving something. Take your feelings out of something as well. Get your feelings out of something. You have a new beginning coming. Some of you could be dealing with a Gemini as well. A Capricorn and a Pisces. Um, you might be separating from something or someone. You have a lot of new beginnings coming your way. It may be shocking and it may come sooner than you think. Um, you're going to get clarity on something. So someone may be making you feel like you're crazy or something could just be driving you crazy. But I feel like you're going to cut through all the bullshit. You're going to you're going to move forward in something. Um all right, Aries, what what does Aries need to What does Aries need to be focusing on? What does Aries need to focus on? So, Goddess, healing feminine energy. What does Aries need to be focused on? The festival. So, creates an energetic blueprint for a fantastic party or event. What does Aries need to be focused on? Three rays of light. So, balancing male and feminine energies, peace and harmony. So, you know what I'm getting as well? I feel like you're on target. That could be an obstacle, too, is trying to find peace and happiness within yourself, within others. Just, you know, I don't know. You could just be feeling like you're not enough, or this could be someone around you. I don't know. All right. Let's do a quick love. All right. Aries. Aries. So, let your friends help you. So, you, there's something to do with finances, career. Maybe you're just focused on um, on your finances. You could just be feeling like someone or something is just not your soulmate. Forgiving and learning. Um, I, I'm seeing a wedding here. Someone could be getting married. Okay, what are your obstacles? Flirting. Finding someone possibly that you can trust. If you have children, trust with your children. Um... Maybe you're not keeping an open mind about something. You or someone else. Okay, what is your outcome, Aries? So worth waiting for. So divine timing is at work in your love life. So you know what? Focus on your career, money. When it comes, it comes. If it don't, it don't. Whatever. That's the way I look at it. So just try to keep an open mind. Um, let go of control. When things are going to happen, when they're not going to happen. So... That is what I have for you, Aries. See you in the next one.